Hello, it's Thursday, April the 8th, 2010, and I'm Martin Smith with the Daily Outlook from Maxiforex. The dollar strengthened against most majors as stocks weakened and commodities fell after Federal Reserve Bernanke said the US economy still faces significant headwinds, leading investors to sell higher risk assets. Crude fell by 1.1% to close at $85.88 a barrel, but gold rose by 1.5% to close at $1,153 an ounce. Today, unemployment claims are expected to decrease from 439,000 to 434,000. The euro fell against the dollar for a fourth day in the longest period of decline since February. Amid speculation, Greece may default, even as leaders try to dispel fears the nation is unhappy with a bailout plan. The euro dollar has been trading downwards in the last few days. Overall, the pair traded with a low of 133.26 and a high of 134.02. The interest rate decision is expected to remain at 0.5. The pound weakened against the dollar after a report showed weaker than forecast growth for UK service companies, adding to concern that the economic recovery may falter. The pound dollar hasn't shown a clear trend in the past few days, trading with a low of 151.38 and a high of 152.86. Today, interest rate decision is expected to remain at 1%. The yen strengthened versus the dollar after US central bank officials said they wanted to keep interest rates low and traders boosted bets China will let the yuan appreciate. The yen also gained against the euro as concern that Europe's economic recovery will slow spark demand for Japan's currency as a refuge. Overall, the dollar yen traded with a low of 93.15 and a high of 94.26. The CAD declined against the dollar after reaching parity for a second consecutive day on speculation that the Bank of Canada will accelerate interest rate increases. The dollar CAD has been trading downwards since February. Overall, the dollar CAD traded with a low of 0.9977 and a high of 1.0062. No economic data is expected today. That's it from me. Be sure to visit us at maxiforex.ru.